In February, Jay-Z sold 50% of his stake in brand Armand de Brignac to luxury goods giant LVMH in a deal Forbes estimates to be worth $630 million. Neither LVMH nor Jay-Z have released the details of the partnership, but Forbes estimates the deal will land the Brooklyn-born mogul $315 million. The deal is huge and will push Jay-Z's billion-dollar fortune even higher, but it's not the biggest celebrity cash-out. When fellow musician Dr. Dre sold Beats to Apple in 2014, the company was valued at $3 billion, earning him $585 million pre-tax. And others in Jay-Z's orbit have also made big bucks with corporate deals. Jay-Z's protege Rihanna made a bulk of her fortune from her makeup brand Fenty Beauty. The line is a partnership between the singer and LVMH, with Rihanna owning a 15% stake worth about $450 million. She also has an $80 million stake in the lingerie line Savage Fenty, also a partnership with Textile Fashion Group. Kanye West cashes in on an interesting profit-sharing agreement with Adidas over his Yeezy brand. While West owns 100% of the brand, Adidas handles the production, marketing, and distribution. West receives royalties of 11%, which Forbes estimates was about $140 million in 2019 on estimated revenues of $1.3 billion. Kylie Jenner's deal with Cody Inc. for 51% of Kylie Cosmetics valued the brand at more than $1 billion, netting Jenner $540 million pre-tax. Cody also teamed up with Kim Kardashian's KKW Beauty, which saw Kardashian give up 20% of the brand that made her $180 million. Her remaining 72% stake in the company is reportedly worth $500 million. Also on the beverage front, George Clooney made big bucks when British liquor giant Diageo purchased the movie star's tequila company Casamigos in 2017. That deal valued the company at up to $1 billion. Clooney netted more than $200 million pre-tax on a deal that saw Diageo pay $700 million up front, with an extra $300 million based on performance over 10 years. For Jay, though, the deal is still huge and only complements his other monetary assets, including Rock Nation's entertainment business, an athlete representation agency, and a second liquor brand, Doucet.